Hey, good morning. Welcome to the book of Philippians. We're chapter 3. Let's take in verses 15 and 16, and then we'll look at it. Therefore, let us, as many as are mature, have this mind. And if in anything you think otherwise, God will reveal even this to you. Nevertheless, to the degree that we have already attained, let us walk by the same rule. Let us be of the same mind. Now, you've noticed here already in the book of Philippians, there's Paul is leading the people together. He wants them to get some more unity going on. They haven't had perhaps all the unity they could have had, although this church doesn't have some of the problems some of the others have had. But let's notice again what we have here. Therefore, let us. So he's, he's drawing conclusions now. We had some of the previous days we've talked about this. Let us, as many as are mature. And there's a question mark. There's a question. Are we behaving in a mature way in our local congregation? Are we, are we mature or are we acting immature? If you go over to chapter 6 of Hebrews, you find what? That Christians are called to go up higher. Sometimes we need to go deeper in the teachings of the scriptures. Let us who are mature have this mind. And if you think something else, then draw close to God. He will reveal to you maybe something that you're missing, that you've been missing. Seek, seek him to the degree that we've already attained. So in other words, we're accountable for having come this far. And what do we need to do? We need to say, yes, here I am. We need to report back for duty today, right where we left off yesterday, and say, God, uh, I know I'm still in the boot camp. We're still growing. Just show me the next step. And God will take us to the, to the next step. You know, all through the days of his ministry throughout Judea, he spent a lot of time on the move. And we as Christians are on the move with Jesus. Let us walk by the same rule. Let us be of the same mind. In other words, let us let us live up to the light we've received. If we've regressed, let us go back and come forward again. And then let us uh, live out the example that Jesus has shown us. Paul's asking the Philippian congregation to do this. So may the Lord help us to live up to the light God has shown us. Hey, let's let's pray together. Your Father in heaven, help us to live up to the light that we've had. Help us to draw close to Jesus every day. Help us to be mature Christians. By now, there's a lot of things we, surely many of us who are listening, should have been should have left behind. And yet we go backtracking and going the wrong way. Oh, Lord, be our helper. Help us to starve self and look to Jesus. That's our prayer today in Jesus' name. Amen. And God be with you today in all that you do.